they're the future of the society. Younger members uh, have all of the new ideas and the great vision and, and they're, they're going to drive where we go on the, in the long term and, and younger members are a critical component of ASCE. I uh, actually started as a younger member and I am so thankful that I did. I have friends across the entire nation as a result of my uh, membership as a younger member. You have to be involved with YMF, that's really where it's at. So started as a student member um, and then uh, once I moved to Seattle after I graduated, I wanted to continue to be involved with um, for main reasons were professional development, community service, networking, and the Younger Member Forum provided a great way to do that. Civil engineering is such a small world. You run into the same people over and over again, and when it's in a great forum like this where everybody is on the same page, focused in, in the same direction, um, when you get to know them through ASC, it just it makes working that much more fun and easy when you know these people that well. It's incredible. It's been really great in that when you do, you know, attend uh, events, whether they're at the branch level or the YMF level, you know, you're meeting people outside of your company. So it allows you to just get to know people that are in the same field or maybe slightly outside your field and it kind of opens you up to just seeing what else is out there and, and how that will basically help you grow as an engineer and a professional. You know, I'm more comfortable now in my job uh, in my career because of my you know, speaking engagements, uh, dealing with contracts, dealing with clients, um, being a project manager. Um, and, and a lot of that's come from AAC and my interactions with other professionals and being able to be a leader in this organization. And it's just been tremendous. I get them involved in the profession right after college. There's a close link when they're together at college level. There's a, there's a bond. And when they first enter the profession, they may feel uncomfortable dealing with uh, more senior folks but they have a support group with the younger member group working together. And they provide a guidance to students as they enter out of college and enter into the workforce. And sometimes it's a lot easier to talk for students to talk to younger engineers than to talk to engineers that are a little bit older. So it helps to ease that transition. And it also helps the development of the young engineers uh, in the skills that they need at that time in their careers. They're always there if we ask for them. I mean, they. And if we have a question or something, I know that that resource is there, that I can count on them to be there for us. It has really helped me in my public speaking skills and a bunch of skills that I don't get at my job. It helps me working on a team and just all my interpersonal skills. This provides them an opportunity for them to gain leadership skills, to understand the organization, to participate at a national level that they might not otherwise get to without these younger member groups. It's an important forum for them. And you know, the last reason that I hear from everybody is they're a lot of fun.